Up until his death, he became an advocate for the indie hustle. So he was one of the first music artists to have a regular newsletter slash email list. And he was definitely one of the first mainstream artists to actually sell music directly from his website. Crystal Ball sold upwards of 200,000 copies at $50 a pop. 200,000 copies by industry standards would be a failure, but when you take the lion's share of the profit, 